I'm Darren Marlar, and this is a Weird Darkness Bonus Bite. From OddityCentral.com, woman requests annulment of marriage with man who blackmailed her into marrying him. A Chinese woman recently filed a lawsuit requesting a divorce from her husband of less than a year, claiming that he blackmailed her into the marriage with some sensitive photos. According to Lee Song Song's lawsuit, she and her husband Tan Dan met in May of 2022 at a party. She didn't pay too much attention to him, but he apparently became obsessed with her, even going to the salon where she worked every day. Because she didn't give him the attention he craved, Tan allegedly started finding ways of chasing clients away from the salon, just so he could be alone with his love interest. However, Song was less than impressed with his tactics and refused to give in to his advances. In a lawsuit, the woman claims that she saw him as an unreliable and conniving person. Apart from Tan Dan's constant harassment, Lee Song Song saw her beauty salon business seriously affected by his antics. The fact that Tan came to her place of work every day and cleverly chased away her clients caused her serious loss of revenue, according to court documents. But little did she know that things could get much worse. In the filed court documents, Lee Song Song alleged that one day, while she was changing clothes in the dressing room of her salon, Tan Dan snuck in and took photos of her with no clothes on. Armed with these sensitive pics, the man confronted the young woman, threatening to send them to her friends and family and post them online if she didn't agree to marry him. Unable to deal with the pressure of having her nude photos leaked, on September 21, 2022, Song agreed to marry her blackmailer, but they never lived together. Then in April of 2023, she realized her mistake and filed a lawsuit, asking for the annulment of the marriage. An investigation followed and a Beijing court recently issued a verdict. The court concluded that Tan Dan's actions, taking indecent photos, threatening to damage her reputation, and interfering with her salon's operations, caused Lee Song Song mental, emotional, and financial harm. Tan Dan himself didn't deny any of the charges during the trial. The marriage was annulled, but it's unclear if Tan faces any other consequences for his actions. Except maybe for the fact that once this gets out, ain't nobody gonna want to date this guy, much less marry him. Find the link to the original story in the show notes, and find more strange, funny, or disturbing news in the Weird News and blog at WeirdDarkness.com. And remember, folks, no means no. And that includes marriage proposals. You know, after my first date with Brenda, she put a padlock on her front door, but that didn't stop me from getting a power drill and a bolt cutter. I think she's just playing hard to get. I knew there was something very wrong with Chuck when one night I caught him riffling through my trash. He told me he was collecting my used popsicle stick so he could remember me. What a sicko. I've been leaving messages on Brenda's answering machine 25 times a day for two months straight. I think the reason she hasn't returned my calls is because she's testing me to see how much I care about her. Yeah, she'll call back. There's a reason why there's an increase in restraining orders from couples who have met on eStalker.com. Hi, I'm Dr. Neil Clarkbar, founder of eStalker.com. Obsession is not just a picture in a paragraph, it's a lifelong commitment. Hi, this is Brenda. Please leave a message. Hi, Brenda. It's me again. Why don't you return my calls? I I'm sorry for painting your car orange. I, I was confused and angry because I love you so much. I love you. You can't leave me. We matched on eStalker.com. Log on to we eStalker.com to and forever. see for yourself Please. why more eStalker matches result in absolute you. disaster than any other dating service out there.